Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video we have a special trick for Samsung Galaxy S20 series in regards to the 120Hz refresh rate and also being able to save your battery even when it is turned on. So let me show you what I'm talking about real quick. When we go to the settings, all right, when I go over to my battery, uh, right over here under device care, if I go to my battery and if I have the medium power savings mode enabled, that is going to save me battery life. But unfortunately, when you have this enabled, the 120 hertz refresh rate gets turned off automatically. So if I go back to my display uh, right over here, as you can see, if I scroll down and tap on motion smoothness, it says not supported in medium power savings mode not the 120 hertz refresh rate. So in this video, we have a trick, a work around this situation, which is gonna allow you to enable 120 hertz refresh rate, even when you have the medium power savings mode enabled. And I do wanna give a quick credit to Adam from Twitter for bringing this to my attention. If you guys wanna send me some tips and tricks, just go to my Twitter, send me a DM, and let me know what you have discovered. Now, Adam did mention that this tip was not his. It's some random Reddit user, but I still want to give a quick shout out to Adam anyway. Thanks for this information. So let's see how to get this rolling. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to your settings, then you want to scroll down to advanced features, and then what you want to do is you want to go into Bixby routines. And under Bixby routines, you have to actually create a specific routine. Now, I'm going to delete this right here because this is the routine you do need to create, but I'm going to show you from, from the very beginning. So what you want to do is you want to click on plus, all right? And then it says if, and under if you have a plus sign, you want to tap on the plus sign, and then you want to go all the way down and choose start button tapped, okay? So if this condition is met, then I'm going to tap on next, then this is what I want to do. I want to scroll down uh, to where it says medium power savings mode, should be here somewhere under battery, uh, right there, okay? So it's all the way at the bottom. You can also search it from the top. So you tap on this, and then you just say okay to this. You say on, you click done. Now we have an if else statement. I'm gonna click on done. It wants you to save it. I'm gonna save it. I'm just gonna say 120 medium, okay? So that means 120 is gonna be enabled at medium. Now I have a big speed routine set up I'm gonna tap on add to home screen, all right? So now it's gonna look like this, but also have a shortcut on the screen that is just gonna be dumped onto the screen. You're not gonna be able to see it. Let me see if I can uh, change the background a little bit. Let me go to the dark mode here. So now you can see it a little bit better. So there's that little icon that you're gonna to need to use. Now, before you tap on this and go nuts, you wanna to go to your settings, all right? And then you wanna go back into the battery. Let's go back to the battery, device care. Go to battery and just go back to the optimized mode for now. Okay, I'm gonna show you what to do next. So now we're good. We have the 120 hertz refresh rate enabled. You can go and double check that right over here. Uh, at the bottom here, it's gonna be motion smoothness. Now we have 120 hertz. Now take a look at this. I'm gonna tap on this. It's gonna enable the, the medium power savings mode. Right now, it is in fact enabled, okay? However, if I go into my display, I still have the 120 hertz refresh rate, even though it says not supported in medium power savings mode. So I am saving some battery, but I'm still getting nice and smooth motion uh, smoothness, all right? So that was a quick tip for you guys with Samsung LCS 20 owners. If you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know. Just make sure to follow step-by-step step exactly what I did if you want to have this enabled. All right, any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Send me tips and tricks via Twitter at Saki Tech Online for a quick shout out. All right, have a fantastic day. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.